But so you're taking unstructured data historically and then structuring it and labeling it and adding it along to the structured data. Yes, exactly. So we've taken that unstructured data, we've layered our own NLP and AI, and I know AI is a, a hot topic Plus these work. days, but it's been our logo for six, seven years now. It's not a new thing for us. Yeah. Um, it's something that we've been doing since the day we started, and it was the whole idea that our founder, Jack, came up with was that we wanted to make sure we we're using the latest technology and the best in technology to search across that unstructured content and make it very easily uh, searchable and, and findable for our, our clients. And so who are your typical clients? You're gonna, you're the ideal clients that you work with right now and then other clients that people may not expect that you work with? Yeah, so we actually have two sides of the business. One is our corporate clients. So those are the largest corporations in the world. And then we also have our financial services clients, which is the, my side of the house that I work on. And that can be anywhere from uh, hedge funds, asset managers, investment banks, private equity firms. We have clients across all those different ranges. Mm -hmm. And then um, when I think about the different use cases and personas within those, yeah. uh, a hedge fund analyst might be using us to search across all, every earnings call over the last five years for certain mentions of topics or phrases or keywords might be reading across 10 Ks, Qs, might want to search across all the sell side research, mm -hmm. across all the brokers to read what they're saying about a topic or a concept. Um, as you move into the private equity side of things, they might be, I mean, even banking as well, more of the investment landscape. I want to understand more about this space. Who are the players here? Who's the, pu the public players versus the private players in that space? And so really getting their bankers and, and junior analysts up to speed on private company names, on the industries they're about to potentially invest in or they're about to embark on. Right.